Hello and welcome back. Once again, you're watching my playthrough of Evergrowth. This incredible, really monumental map. Um, puzzle block pushing map that I've been playing. It's a lot of fun. The puzzle design is great. And uh, one thing I noticed when um, editing the last video was um, some of the pixel art in this. Um, particularly these uh, these like mossy uh, drippy bits it just looks so iconic and interesting and it gives like a really good vibe like a really cool feel and the color palette reminds me of um, I did mention Tomb Raider last time like the old Tomb Raider games but also another really old game I think it's called um, Flashback I uh, don't know if anyone watching this is old enough to remember that old 2D game, Flashback. But um, it has a similar kind of uh, aesthetic. Anyway, we were trying to do this puzzle here. I love that sound. We're trying to do this puzzle here. Um, I think that the solution to this puzzle... And the puzzle being, we want to get a block out of this room. Uh, I think the problem is solvable using just these three blocks and the pushing mechanic. We know we can do that. Um, and that's where we left it last time. One thing I noticed is that um, this is actually taller than than one block so it's not like I can push that block over here right I can't push this block over that but if we still had the three stack it might be possible I don't I'm not entirely sure if it is but it could be possible that we could possibly push the top block on top of that um, but I wouldn't know how to get up there so we're left with the other problem which is how do we get a block around here um, without it running into this wall or more specifically once it's here, oh, it's simple. There we go. There we go. In fact, we have two blocks. Yep, I think we've still got two blocks. We do. Yeah, these, these two puzzles in particular, I think, have been the best so far. Um, really quite challenging, for me at least. And um, feel re really rewarding having solved them. I haven't solved it, though. Problem is not solved. Right, okay. Well, <laughs> once again, I feel like we've got. Let's reset it. I feel like we've got a catch 22, right? Because it's almost like we need just one extra block. Because we could put this here again. Um, that way we could push two blocks off. Would that have helped us? Yes. Because the only way to get blocks out of this room, as far as I can tell, is to push them from here. You can't get up here without first... Let's 
try again. Or is it that I need a block from in here? It could be that instead. Let's take a second look at this one. I know I'm going in circles here. But I think I only cared about getting one block out of this room. No, it's only possible to get one block out of this room. Unless... Yeah. I think I think actually instead of taking this block out perhaps we can we're supposed to oh no because let me get my head straight here <laughs> um, the problem is we're not going to be able to push these from a stair, right? So once we're standing here, I won't be able to push that block. Try this way. No, because I can't. I don't think I can get that. You know what? I think I'm. I think I'm done trying. Which is fine we've got enough blocks we've got enough blocks to continue just not to get the flower and i would like to get the flower but not so much that i'm gonna stay in this room for any longer i think that's what it is though because i'm quite sure you can only get one block out of this room so there's something I think here but I don't know what it is because oh well let's carry on another thing I noticed in editing is that um, that bird that flew off in the first episode of this and now these birds 
like there's such a lifelike feel to them that Minecraft usually lacks. The amount of care and attention that went into that bird flying is just like astounding. Sir Stroming, is that that really, really disgusting fish thing that <laughs> I think I've heard of that? I'm looking around not really for clues but for just just to get this vibe of being on this rooftop here I'm just really enjoying it all right but we do have to go back is this where I came up no this is where I came out though oh I can't do that Did it again. I forget that I reset your position. Do I have to like cycle? I think I have to cycle them through. Let's reset the whole thing. No, you can't. Can't move that. Let's, uh, no, we reset it again. It looks like we have to pass the top block over somehow. I think we need to do this. Oh, no, not that. Maybe that. I'm going to test something. If I put it against this edge and stand up here and crouch. No, there's nothing. So I think... I think that I somehow need to... push this back. No, because I can't push it right against the wall. Unless... No. Okay, so neither of them can touch the wall. Close, but not close enough. Okay, let's leave that there for a minute. I think there are other things to do around here. I thought I saw another puzzle. Did I go through here? I did. I've been there. Uh, 
That looks interesting. to stay there for now I think Okay, and he's put that there first, then that there, and then I think that there, and that way I should hopefully No, that's not going to do it either Oh, okay. I think this does come down. Yes, but once it's against this edge... And it's not like I can just drop behind this box and push it out because then I'm stuck. Let's see what else is around here. There's another puzzle I can't figure out right now.
don't know. I just feel like I just... I haven't got the brain power for these. None of them actually feel doable. Like, look at this. The only way of pushing it out to this wall is there. It feels like I need to pull them. to stack them here that's that's what it is so how do we start this again I think I'll push this over here then this like that right <laughs> honestly every time like every puzzle recently I feel like I feel like there's just one small thing Getting in the way of my ideas. How could I do this? Could I push this? I shouldn't push this forward, right? Because if I push this forward, I'm st I'm stuck, kind of on the outside. Let's reset it again. Try doing it this way. Push that. Unless what I need to do is push the other one first. Let's try that. Yeah. There we go. There we go. I was starting to think all of these are impossible. Okay, there's one. I don't know what it did. I assume I just need to get all three puzzles and that will open the gate. But it did sound like something unlocked. But it weren't anything in here. The next easiest one. Oh. There we go, one of the three gates. Let's just reset this one. So let's declare the rules. I believe no none of these blocks can touch 
an outer edge because we need all three of them in there. Right? I think that's the case. So that must mean there's a way within these nine blocks on the inside of here, or 12, to, to get this, this block over the top. It can't go this way. So that also means that we can't actually shift the top the top block onto the other because we'd need to be able to walk onto it. So given all of that, I think it's possible to maneuver this stack over there somehow. But we have to get this block out of the way. And we can do that here, so let's do that. So I think we can put that here. But if we were to put it here, we can't actually push this stack over. It's not like we can put it here and then cycle it around because it won't get past this wall. Um, so let's reset it. Maybe actually we move it backwards. We can't really do that either. Well, we could push this over here. Yeah, there we go. Got to be careful now because, oh no, this is fine. I think we can put that there and then move it back again. You're not going to go over there, are you? I think it should be fine. There we go, second gate. Didn't hear that one unlock though. So we just need the third one. So how do we do it? We only need two of these blocks. Now this could be a distraction. You know, like uh, I thought if I drop this block down here, I can get that that other block. But actually, if we can't get the blocks together, what good is it? So maybe we just try and stack these two over here. Would that be possible, I wonder? Might be. Ah, this is against the wall, though. I think that should be fine. No, it's not fine. Because we still can't get it out. Unless we can get it over that grating there. And we can't. So it's never any good for us to drop uh, these two blocks down this edge. So we do 
absolutely need. Oh, okay. What if? No, don't do that. We need to keep this block here because we're going to push it over to that other side, I think. I think that's the way of doing it. Now, if I was just to drop this block down here, it's going to push this one backwards. Um, so... Uh, I didn't want to do that. Let's undo it. Um, I was just going to crouch to look over this edge. Um... How do we do it? We want to push this down, but we want to make sure that we can still get behind this block. If I was to push it against this wall, it won't come away from the wall. If I was to push it against this edge, I don't think there's any way of getting it back from this edge. It might be possible if we could... Um, use a block to push it back but I don't think I don't think so what if we just put that there for the moment um, that's, that's not the solution So to put this down here, wait, what if there's another block around here somewhere? It's certainly not in there. There was something around here, weren't there? These. You can't do anything with these. You can't get a block through there either. Can't do anything with those. So. Yeah, I think it seems likely at the moment that this problem is solvable with these three blocks alone. Um, and I do think the solution is to drop this block down here and pass this block over and stack it on top of the other block and then move that into place. Let's see if we can do that. Yeah, so once it's here, it's just going to be an easy push into here. Um, it's just this problem here. we do it we can never push a block against this side if we intend on using it again so we know that's not the solution I don't think we can allow this block to come over here um, I mean, we can't no matter what, right? Well, we could. Like, if there was another block out here, uh, we could probably, on a corner, um, wrap around, stand on that block, and then push this block back forward. Um, and that's not the case here, right? So, like, if, um, if we had another block in here... Well, it, no, that is the case. So we could place it there and then kind of shift on a corner to get behind this block and push it back. So, how else do we do it? If I was to push this block forward first, it 
doesn't really help us. Okay, I think I've got it. I think the solution... Yeah, the solution is to push that over there and then drop it down. And then we can slide it in sideways. These are really good puzzles. But the, <laughs> the thing that concerns me is that they're so early on you know, like you can see over there, there's like a whole more complex mechanic going on. And this is just like the starter and I'm really struggling. <laughs> so I'm not sure how much further I'm going to get with this. See you in the next one.